Okay, we're going in. Look, look, Catherine. <laughs> Third is set. Ooh. Ooh. All the gooey stuff. Put your fingers on the gooey stuff. Yes, yes, that was a good job. Team. Team. We do need a group shot. This is a very nice man. Use the camera again. <laughs> I'll my camera. Down, goes down. Goes up. Books. Books. <laughs> Panels. Chairs. Round things. Round things. Round things. Was it round things? Round things. And an yeah, open one. On. That like the is that the drink, sir? Uh, so I'm going to take it up the stairs. Okay. As it were. <laughs> do we, do we need to get the central column in, do you think? <laughs> 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 do you want to get. Oh, get everybody, yeah, everybody yeah, ready. My knees aren't going to take oh. it anymore. Okay. I need to move a bit left. Do you know? Oh, oh, oh. So, taking in three, two, one. <laughs> oh, there we go. I'll take you three, two, one. That's one. Don't move. Don't move. Oh, don't move. Oh, no. There's four of these guys. Oh, oh, yeah. Are you being paid by the hour? Take any other photos. Taking in three, two, one. Oh, nice. Go. That's up. Two more. Three, two, one. And someone's left it on the corner. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, yeah. well, that's fine. <laughs> that does the job. Yeah. Turn the round button round to the green camera symbol. Ooh. That's it. Ooh. Right, run right back again. Oh. Right, and again. That's it. Three, two, one. <laughs> <laughs> that's much better, actually. You're as left wing. It's <laughs> 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 not that old fashioned camera thing. Oh, no. I like old fashioned. <laughs> I'm the last generation that remembers film you know, so. <laughs> Same here. Does that still it? have a film camera? Oh, God, there's oh, one another more, one. One more. Oh, one more. Oh. 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 Got to unlock it. No, you can you happy down there? Isomorphic. How's your, how are your knees down there? <laughs> I'm not mine for the I heard some cracking, that's out of the floor. Three, two, one. There we go. Thank you. Oh, yeah. Someone give this man a tip. The <laughs> 4.30 from Goldmark. Don't take more cameras for anyone ever again. Oh, that's a good Police box out there. So, I give you lots of numbers. Currently, we're in the low power lighting state. We're using about 3,000 watts of power to TARDIS. 3 kilowatts. Full power lighting state goes up to 30,000 watts. So, Ooh. you can imagine quite how hot it gets in here. Yeah, so as my car takes the charge. Yeah. Oh, okay. And the floors no longer creak when you jump up and down them, like you used to do back in the Matt Smith days. Well, this is a new floor. Is it? Yes. Um, so these little circles here, they do allow steam to be shot yes. up through them, yep. which is really, really cool. Uh, however, no one did the math. The very, very hot water plus MDF floor ah. equals a bit of a sodden mess, to be honest. So they did replace <laughs> this floor entirely. It is actually, you're right, you, can't, you don't actually see the, the joins anymore. Like no, you you're right. Matt Smith. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> All of this is powered by five miles worth of cable. It took a team of four electricians 14 days to wire everything. <laughs> Treasure by the hour, no doubt. Yeah. <laughs> Any target books up there? 
Sorry? Any Target books? Any Target Doctor books up there? No, no, no. no Doctor Who books. Capaldi's not sneaked any up there. Yeah, yeah. One or two, I think, in the... Tenth Planet, part four. There are hidden things, things you'd never even see. There is Snakes and Ladders up there, for example. Oh, really? In one of the chests up there. And the skull there. Is that from... Uh, yes. Maybe. <laughs> I, I actually do not know. I don't think it is. Okay. Small one. It looks a bit more realistic than the ones we, that were in the experience bit. Yeah, well, apparently it was meant to be um, Calvis. Actually was. Oh, well, he defleshed him and yes. took a mould yeah, of his they, skull and put yeah. a flesh back on it. Yes. Okay. That's the working for arts there, isn't it? <laughs> I know just a fun fact those books at the top shelf there. Yep. Uh, Danish. <laughs> Danish, okay. They're Danish. Uh, they're Danish translations. So okay. Wuthering Heights is up there. Um, so Three Musketeers. In Danish. <laughs> they just found them randomly at a junk shop, did they? It's got about eight copies of Les Mis. Okay. <laughs> might be a we thought one might be enough, but you know. Uh, <laughs> So I'm guessing you all know the reason why the console is split into six. Because uh, it was taken apart in one of the episodes. <laughs> well, it's meant to be six people. Well, it's meant to be six people flying it. Oh, is right. it? So, <laughs> the oh, universe reason. Split six <laughs> but the real reason is just convenient to build sided. back in the 1963. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Each of those is meant to represent a different way of powering the TARDIS. So this takes inspiration from an electric power station. Oh, a bit around yeah. the back is a steampunky array of gears and cogs, and that bit over there takes inspiration from railway signal boxes. Ah, and the squidgy bit? Squidgy bit is the telepathic circuits. Yeah. No, no particular inspiration for that that we know of? Uh, yeah, squidgy bit. by telepathic circuits. Yeah, oh, okay. It's by Yeah. Yes. It's just what safety aid box. Inspired by an unfortunate yeah. event when they're trying to come into Even a country. Crash, your eggs aren't going to break. A few of the more modern touches that even the... Uh, the frozen scene before, you have the mats that Bill bought the Doctor for Christmas. Oh, really? Yeah. We also have the pot of Sonics that she played with. Yes. The pilot. I can reveal that those Sonics and the ones in the episode actually were all points. They bought them from the Doctor experience. <laughs> <laughs> you charged them <laughs> uh, The rings up there, there's 18 symbols on each of those concentric rings, which mimics the amount of steel beams around the S. There's 18 of those as well. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm not going to play even more when I say uh, Hartnell was very disappointed with his TARDIS that when he pulled the lever, nothing happened, and actually, most of the buttons they didn't even be pressed, even way up to the 80s, oh. the, uh, the buttons on the console, most of them you couldn't even push them in. Yeah. It's not the case on this, they all work. Are they all work? Yeah. <laughs> pretty much all of them, yeah. All pretty much every LED that you see on there when you flick the switch, it, they come on and off. Right. So he does That's get the time lever. A few raspberry pies in there, maybe. Adam, Adam, you distract him. <laughs> Look over there! <laughs> um, oh, there we go. Just a guitar. Uh, I take it when the, they're filming, they, they tend to cover the, the holes in the... Uh, yeah, the corridors yeah, yeah. in the Doctor's room. Uh, when we go out later on, the bit of grey next to the uh, the grey boards in the uh, the okay. in front of the... Uh, okay. I think they built out a corridor once in uh, during the centre of the TARDIS, that one. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I always want to say into the TARDIS, because yeah. it's the dialogue. Yeah. <laughs> Are you filming, boy? No, I've stopped. <laughs>